Breaking news. Sony just released the trailer for their new movie, Craven the Hunter, and it looks epic. But the one question on everyone's mind is, will Spider-Man be in this movie? And which Spider-Man will show up? Let's find out. Sony has been trying to build a Spider-Man cinematic universe of their own for quite some time now. They've had little success with the Venom movies, but their other projects like Madame Web and Morbius didn't turn out too great. That's not all. They don't even have a proper Spider-Man to lead their cinematic universe. But now, after multiple failures, it looks like they might have a turning point with Kraven. Yes, Kraven the Hunter is a classic villain from the Spider-Man franchise, and he's a founding member of the Sinister Six. When Sony was making Amazing Spider-Man 2, the director, Mark Webb, wanted to put him as a villain in the movie, but canceled the idea at the last minute. Now, we're getting a standalone Craven movie. The film stars Aaron Taylor Johnson as Craven, but before he got the role, producers actually went to Brad Pitt, Keanu Reeves, John David Washington, and Adam Driver to see if any of them wanted to play the role. Russell Crowe will play Craven's father in the movie, Ariana DeBose will play Craven's love interest, and Alex Alessandro Nivola will be playing the film's main villain, the Rhino. The other villain in the movie will be played by Christopher Abbott. He'll be playing a character called the Foreigner, and the movie will be directed by J.C. Chandor. Judging from the trailer, we believe the movie is going to focus on Craven's journey as he goes on a quest to establish himself as the best hunter in the world. When asked more about the movie, Aaron Taylor Johnson revealed that his version of Craven is a big animal lover and protector of nature, while director J.C. Chandor said the movie is going to have a very dark vibe. But hold on, will Spider-Man be in this movie too? Well, we're not sure, but based on the rumors, Sony is considering bringing back Garfield Spider-Man, and if he ends up making a cameo in this movie towards the end credits, then it'll be a mega treat for the fans. Craven the Hunter is just what Sony needs right now. Looking at how Deadpool 3's R-rated vibe saved Marvel from dying, it seems Sony can do the same with Craven the Hunter and probably also get another new franchise on their hands. Sony desperately needs the lifeline right now. After Madam Web's colossal failure, they need a movie to save them. Otherwise, they'll have to pull the plug on their Spider-Man universe sooner than they thought. Let's hope it doesn't come to that. That's all for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>